What is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's your dude, RefrigerTube. And today, we are opening the newest Yu-Gi-Oh! booster packs. Which are the Legendary Duelist, Immortal Destiny. Which is pretty cool because Bakura, one of my favorite bad guys in the Yu-Gi-Oh! series. Being as he's been there since the beginning. And, and he was the biggest of the big bads. Like, he was basically manipulating the entire story to get the pharaoh to go back to ancient Egypt. Yeah, it, it's it's amazing. So, but we're going to open up six of these. Make a little quick short one, guys. Uh, maybe, maybe we'll pull something good. Maybe not. Probably not, actually. But, out of six packs... We can hope. Plus, in a booster box, you're guaranteed stuff. I like not being guaranteed. Because then if I pull even... Because I can pull more, technically. In a booster box of 36, you're guaranteed, like, 5 ultras, X amount of supers. I could theoretically get 6 ultras here. And spend way less. So, this this is uh, this archetype. Sorry if my voice sounds weird. I just woke up from a nap. So, the archetype for this is like the Destiny board. Uh, or Final Passage thing. I can't remember. And, uh, Call of the Earth. Oh, yeah, Earthbound. There's Earthbound support in this. Gimm gimmick Puppet, Dread Doll. An Ultra Rare Dark Spirits Mastery. See, look at that. First pack, and we already get an Ultra Rare. I don't think you're guaranteed. I do not think you are guaranteed. No, of course you're not. Because that would make that would make that would make it so it's easy to get all the all of them. Let me let me just double check. Yeah, no guarantee. What the hell is that? Oh, that's cool. There's little survey things in the booster packs. I didn't know Konami did that anymore. I didn't know Konami did that, period. Must be must be relatively new. If you guys, if you guys are Yu-Gi-Oh! fans and you're watching this right now, uh, and you guys want to see more Yu-Gi-Oh! openings, let me know in the comments below. Uh, I usually do a little bit every time a new set comes out. Uh, only a rare... Oh no! Every time a new set comes out, I try to do a few packs. Get a few uh, blister packs. Uh, I try to do it with Dragon Ball Super TCG as well. But nobody really comments. So I don't do more. Oh, we got a super rare Predaplant. Oh yeah, the Predaplant supports in here too. Very nice. Cool super rare, guys. We Is that two or three times we just pulled that? Was that the same rare three times? Oh no, two times. But still, two times, that's... Uh, that's that's pretty... That That's impressive. Same exact rare, two times out of three so far. And so far, this, this, we've only opened up three packs. And we've already gotten an Ultra and a Super, so... This is why I like these, because... I'm not 100% sure. But those two could be worth a, a bit of... We've had this in every pack, I swear to God. I'm not going to go back and look, but I'm pretty sure I saw that in every pack. Supe. Another super rare. Earthbound Geoglyph. Hey, and a different rare. Very nice. Very nice. I'm not, I don't usually, like I said, I don't usually do Yu-Gi-Oh openings, so the sleeves are in a different location. So, out of four packs, we got three foils. We're doing really good on, uh, with our pull rates right now. So, that's awesome. We got an Earthbound Immortal Revival. We got a Supe again. Evil. Oh, yeah, the evil hero archetype in here. Oh, no. We're just going to get a rare. Performer Puppet. Perform Puppet. And, guys, this is the last pack of the video. Like I said, if you guys do enjoy Yu-Gi-Oh! openings, if you want to see me do more or bigger openings, like more than six packs, obviously, uh, leave a comment. If you guys do enjoy Yu-Gi-Oh! content, I love Yu-Gi-Oh! cards. I love collecting uh, certain cards. 
So I have no problem with doing more of this. So let's hope this last pack is a super rare. At least we did get another super rare to end the video. So out of six packs, we got four foils, which is really good considering the pull rates are not that. All right, guys. Thank you for watching the video. If you guys enjoyed the content today, hit that subscribe button and join the Red Bar Rebellion. And I'll see you in the next video.